going on my beautiful people this is your boy kevin back again today i have a flagship crazy phone amazing phone for you guys to review this phone only costs around 500 dollars and it is flagship can beat almost most of the flagship phones up there 500 dollar phone you go buy a flagship phone even we're gonna just say samsung s23 ultra two thousand dollars crazy specs it's almost same specs You'll see what I'm talking about, guys. Love this phone. We got the Nubia Z50. Amazing camera. The new chipset Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. 35mm camera. Do you want me to stop? Go on, guys. Anyways, let's go unbox this beast, guys, first. Let's see what's inside of it. How does it look like? And we're going to come back here. I'm going to let you guys know everything you need to know about this beast. I'm going to do full camera test on it. Performance. Whatever you need. I see you guys in a second. We have Z50 Nubia, it says right on the box in black and red. And here is transparent. Let's get this beast out. Okay, put this away first. Let's see what's in the box. Here should be the case, I think. Yes, it is. You get a SIM key. You get manual books and you got the case in here. Ooh, the case is the same color of the phone. Looks really nice. Look at that. And you got the Nubia sign right there. Looks really, really nice, guys. Very, very strong. I'm going to try it on for you guys so you guys can see in a minute. Now, in here should be the cables. Let's see. I think it is the cables. Yes, it is the cables. And the cable, it's in red color. Very strong cable. Look how thick this thing is. Very, very thick. And in here should be that supercharged 80 watt, I think. Let's see. Yes, it is. Look at that. And it's not even that heavy. It's pretty light. It's good uh, weight on it to carry it around. Really like it. It's like black color as well, too. Now let's get into the phone. We gotta take this plastic thing off love the color love the design love how it looks look at the back of this thing guys this one is the leather one and you can get this in glass as well too i like the leathery because if i drop it it's not gonna break that easy look at that look at that color feels so good when you're touching it and i love to put a print in there nubia and look at that camera setup on here. So beautiful. Look at this. Look at the ring around it. You got like a, a chrome looking ring and you got another shiny chrome in there. And you got, let me bring it closer. Look at two and three. And look at the side of it. Looks so nice. Look at this. And you got aluminum frame all around on this. And gotta love that back curve. And you gotta front display curve as well too and you got your selfie camera right there and phone comes with on display as well too and it's not uh light it's not heavy it's like between it's got some good weight on it feels good when you're holding it and i like it because it fits in my hand fits really good looks really nice like come on guys let me know in the comment what you guys think and you got your on and off button here your volume rockers right there so far i'm loving this let's try that case almost same color look at this okay let's put it on oh it looks pretty good feels really good i love that curve on it makes it more curvier and it does protect your camera look at this so if you put it on a flat surface move it around you're good to go your display too is covered too you got bumps here bumps there you put it like this it's not even touching your display looks really good I love that case. I love that color of the case. Almost the same color like the phone, isn't it, guys? Almost same color. Ooh, what did it feel? Oh, something fell out of there. Looks pretty good. I really like it. And I love, hold on, let me show you guys that curve in the back and that uh, leathery back on it and the color and that curve. Look at that. You have to love that beautiful color on this. It actually suits the phone. And you have that slight curve in the back as well too. And look at the camera setup on this thing. Looks really nice. I love the way they made the circles. You got a black, you got chrome, flat chrome, then you got shiny chrome, then you got a little red thing around the camera.
and you got the logo right there that makes it look really good pop out I like to put the case on it because this phone leather I don't know you might get dirty scratches something like that on it the case is actually really strong it does protect the phone and you gotta love that display on this thing beautiful display and it comes with a curve as well too it's got like slight curve on the display feels really good when you're holding this phone like it's not too big it's not too small it's like perfect size feels good I can sit and talk on this phone all day long or play games on it that curved display just makes a lot of difference on this phone and phone comes with a 6.7 inch AMOLED 1B color 1080 times 24 um, uh, resolution and I did a test on it uh, for brightness it's got thousand nets so I uh, uh, turn all the lights off in my house in like really really dark room and I took a video for you guys so you guys can see the brightness in a dark room if you look at it close it gets bright bright and speakers on this beast get really loud like I had them compared to my s23 ultra I'm actually gonna do a my review on the s23 ultra and this one performance test uh, and speed test uh, that's what I'm going to be doing on my next video. And believe me, you guys want to watch this video. It will amaze you which phone is going to win. It will shock you. Believe me. So yeah, I was talking about the display. And if you want to watch videos on this phone, you will actually enjoy it. It's got a very nice uh, vivid colors on it. If you're watching Netflix, YouTube, whatever you're watching on this phone, you will actually enjoy it. And I'm going to mention again, very loud speakers. Let's go watch a quick video on this, guys. this thing you get like all aluminium frame all around on this this phone comes with most powerful chips in the market right now snapdragon 8 gen 2 powerful it's a beast if you're a gamer you can throw any kind of game on this phone will handle it like a gaming phone you can hand you can now uh, download anything from anywhere within minutes on this beast and it gets better guys refresh it on this beast it goes auto 60 120 144 let me show you guys the refresh it on this beast refresh it i mentioned again auto 60 120 and 144 so i'm going to put it at 120 first let me show you guys how smooth it is look how smooth this thing is like so fast like blink of an eye and if you want to open something this thing is very quick very fast response really quick and now i'm going to try the 144 hertz this is for the gamers out there if you're playing a lot of gaming this is what you want smoothest display you can ever get so we're going to go 144 to you guys it might look the same like the 120 but to me it does look more smoother it's more faster response and uh it's like did you see that like opening something is way more quicker way more faster so I'm going to mention again, 144 hertz, throw it at this beast and go play a game. I'm telling you, you're going to have an experience of lifetime. Let's do a quick gaming test on this beast.
I really wanted to know the scores on this uh, beast. What is it on uh, Geekbench? I done a lot of Geekbench uh, uh, test uh, performance test on my other flagship phones and uh, expensive phones. This was the highest score I ever got on any phone so far. The score on this beast is insane on Geekbench. Let's go and see. So we got a single score of 1890, multiple score of 5,226. That is insane scores. This is the highest scores I've seen on any flagship phone so far. That really surprised me guys right now. And phone comes with on display. So if you have a board sitting at a coffee shop or somewhere and there's no internet or anything, you just want to go through like uh, through the pictures, it's got beautiful pictures. You gotta love that on display. So if you have a board, just uh, customize it, put your own images and just go through them. It's got a lot of beautiful images on it. Now, best part of this is camera. 13 five millimeter guys. Woo! It's got a lot of features for a camera. Like if you go open the camera, it's got so many, sorry, freaking features. Samsung S23 Ultra don't even have that much. Or other flagship phone. They threw everything in this. I was shocked when I was going through the, the, this, uh, the settings on it. I'm like, wow, someone told me like, are you even gonna use them or not? So now, let me show you guys quick um, uh, the specs of the camera. Then I'm gonna show you guys a little bit uh, the camera, uh, some of the features that it come with. I did took it outside and I did a quick video for you guys. Let's go guys, we're gonna go camera, we're gonna go the ultra wide. Look how white this thing gets, it does a, such a good job. We're gonna go to one time again, and I'm gonna go back to white again, so you can see the difference. Look at this thing, it gets so white. Now we're gonna go th three times, that's three times zoom. And now we're gonna flip this up, we're gonna go up to 20 times zoom. And it does such a clear job, look at that. Look how far I can uh, look and take a picture. And you got your AI on top, your HDR, your filters. And we're gonna go to Pro Mode. This is for professional people that know how to use the camera. I'm not, so I cannot use it. You got your Street Mode. And we got Camera Family. This is where it gets good, guys. Look how many features are there that you can use. It has so many features that you can play around with. And we're gonna go back all the way to our video. Let's try the wide angle. Same thing, does amazing job, gets really wide, you get the whole image. And now we're gonna go push this up and it goes up to 15 times zoom on the video. And for video, you can record max 8K on this beast. And we got your night mode and we got the portrait. Let me show you guys the portrait a little bit. And you can play around with your face beauty. You can adjust it more or less. And that's for the features for the camera. Now, let me show you guys some of the pictures and some videos that I took with this phone and you guys can judge it yourself and let me know in the comments what you guys think. This image you see right now, I'm going to be taking the same image with the wide angle. 
and that's the wide angle look how wide it gets this image you see right now I'm gonna be using 20 times zoom that's 20 times zoom you can see the actual camera across I took this video 4K 60 close-up shot so you guys can see the difference between them. And this video you guys see is 4K 60. I turned on the video stabilizer and I'm doing fast jogging. Uh, took a big turn and you can see it does a really good stabilizing and I'm gonna be running uh, pretty soon this is where I'm gonna start running uh, right here look at this this video store is so stabilized it does an amazing job the video stabilizer and this video is 1080p I took it with a selfie phone comes with NFC the NFC on this phone it does work with Google Pay so I did want to try it so I download my uh, uh, what is it the Google Pay app and I download my bank information and I went to the store I actually paid with it it did actually work and the good thing about this phone is you got dual Wi-Fi connection so if your Wi-Fi is a little bit sl slow you can turn on the dual Wi-Fi connection on this phone and the phone gets way faster so you go here then it's right there, you turn it on, dual Wi-Fi connection. Then you can use your dual Wi-Fi for faster speed. I think everything on this phone was perfect. $500 phone, you got 1000 no, sorry, this one is over $2,500. This is one terabyte. S23, $2,000. You got Xiaomi phones, flagship, around $1,500 or whatever. I'm $500, flagship specs, flagship camera if you're looking for a gaming phone this is it if you're looking for a powerful phone this is it if you're one of those guys take a lot of pictures a lot of videos this is the phone for you this phone is everything i am telling you i'm giving you guys my opinion on it i am not sponsored by this i actually bought this phone myself to do a review on it no one is paying me for it i'm giving you guys my honest truth if you buy this phone you will love it i'm gonna leave it as that i'm gonna catch you guys on my next video peace out for now